On today's episode of It's Super Cold Outside, we have the same cute little jacket, little slippies, on over our pajamas. Oh yeah. It's uh, it's only zero out today, but it's still super cold, huh, baby? Yeah. Also, if you're a parent or you watch children, you'll know that uh, Cocoa Melon is the newest craze. It's really, uh, really not our favorite. Well, it's her, not her favorite, but she definitely likes it. Say happy Monday. So when it's just Winnie and I, I usually just make her an egg really quick because it's super easy. Here, would you like to have some eggs? I guess I could give you a piece of cheese too. Mmm, nama. Oh, okay. Okay, you ready to get the egg off of you and get dressed for the day? Wanna get dressed? We gotta get ready so that when you're done with your nap, we can go to Nani's house. Oh! Was that a toot? Was that a little baby toot? <laughs> Are you a big girl playing with your toys? Hi. I try to move her to different rooms as much as possible while I'm trying to get her to her next nap. She didn't have the best night of sleep but I'm still trying to push her wake window all the way to 10 for her first nap. If she gets up around seven, we usually shoot for 10 to 10.30. If she gets up at eight or later, then we usually shoot for like 11.30. But I like to get her dressed before her nap. Usually after breakfast, we have to change her outfit anyways. So I like to put her outfit on for the day so that when she wakes up from her nap, she's ready to go. I usually don't have to work until after her first nap, so it works out really well. Oh, baby. You can do it. You're doing a good job. Um, it's nice then she can get her first nap in at home because she always sleeps the best, obviously, in her own room. But, huh, baby girl. Winnie is down for her nap. Um, she's been sleeping for a little over an hour. I got nervous because she woke up at like after 30 minutes and was like screaming but she recovered so that's good um I think I'm gonna switch diaper bags we have two diaper bags but I'm actually gonna switch into a bag that's not even a diaper bag this is supposed to be like my work bag which I'm sure in like a month ish I'll switch back to this but I just like hate bringing her to i mean to anybody's house and having like a bag a bottle bag like a blanket a coat like all of these things so i think this is gonna be bigger so we're gonna try to uh switch it all in there i guess i could also do like a mini what's in our diaper bag all right so we have a sleep sack so i'm gonna put this little fur jacket that her uncle Matthew got her on her today. So I'll leave that out. And then just a little hat there. Mittens, which I'm sure she'll take off. And then her little pink Uggs. So I'll leave that on the top of the bag. So this is a changing mat. Um, this is the Herschel diaper bag, which we really like. Um, we wanted a camel one, but this is a really big mat to like lay her out and change her on. So we have that in the diaper bag. We have a wet to dry bag in case she poops or like gets crap all over her clothes. Um, we have a couple teethers, a nooka with a clip. We have one, two, three, four, five diapers. I don't have to bring diapers because we leave them there. Another teether, a pack of wipes, her diaper cream and diaper paste. Um, medicine, so there's Tylenol in here, our homeopathic medicine, and then also a temperature thing. An extra outfit. We, I usually just pack like a onesie because it takes up less space and it's just one thing. Um, an extra bib. More homeopathic medicine. This is the Highlands. These are little tablets. The other ones we have are liquid. 
which this is mine. More diaper rash cream lotion in case she's super dry because it's cold out. Another nook. And then we have puffs. Oh my god, another nook. Okay, this is exactly why I'm going through this. Puffs for a snack, another nook. A small blanket, which we don't really need. A burp cloth, which we also don't really need. Um, these are for like parents. They're alcohol-free hand sanitizing wipes. Um, and more diaper rash cream. And we have wafers. Those can probably fit in here. There's also some stuff in the sides of the diaper bag, which usually is like my stuff. But I don't really think we need any of that. Tissues, breast pads, looks like lip gloss, a mask, mints, more breast pads. Oh, this is her insurance card, which we should keep in there. And lip gloss. <laughs> more breast pads, chapstick, a lipstick, and Benadryl. <laughs> Perfect. This guy has nook cleaner wipes, hand and face wipes, which we don't really need. We have foaming dish bottle soap, soothing protectment ointment, we also don't really need that. SPF, we also don't really need that. And this is lip and face balm. So these are all the things. These are the things that are gonna go back in the bag along with the bottles. Are you awake? <gasps> this little baby had a two hour and 20 minute nap. Did you have such a good nap? Did you need that extra sleep? What are you looking for? All right, you ready to eat some lunchy? I love you. Love you. <gasps> I know you're not coming over to knock over my tower. Ugh. Don't do it. Don't knock it over. Yeah, you see the fireplace is on? Yes, that's what's making that noise. Can you say, Happy Tuesday! Happy Tuesday! We um have, I don't know if you can see it, an infected finger. So I think she must have had a hangnail. She must have had a hangnail or something. And now it's a little infected. We messaged the pediatrician and he said that it might clear up on its own, but I just, I don't know. I don't really wanna wait for that. We've been washing it. So I've been washing her hands like every hour-ish with antibacterial soap and then just let it dry out. Last night I did put triple antibiotic on it, um, which I might do like before her nap today. Are you so cute? You wanna take your nooka out and say hi? Say hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. <gasps> hi guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. <sighs> um. But I'm just gonna keep washing it, try to let it dry out as much as possible. I'm probably gonna call the pediatrician since they're open now. I don't know what it is about being a mom and like not drinking your coffee when you're supposed to, but I'm gonna really try hard to get at least one warm cup of coffee in today. This little guy right here, it's called the grapple. So it suctions on to whatever you put it on and then you can just connect the toys because she's in that stage where she just wants to throw everything. Huh, you just wanna throw everything? Shout out to Auntie Lexi for this cute little fleece. It's perfect to wear over whatever cause it's so freaking cold. So it's about 8.15 right now. She got up at about 7.15. I feed her right when she wakes up. And then she, what is that number calling me? Um, and then she typically will only nurse for like, I don't know, two or three minutes. And then usually like 30 to 45 minutes later, I have to feed her again, which is kind of seems to be where we're at right now. And then we eat breakfast after that. So you wanna go have some milky? 
so I don't know about any of you, but when I'm trying to get stuff done around the house, it's really hard for me. Um, Cody always is like, how do you do anything? Because I start to do one thing and then I see something else and then I'm over here, I'm over there, I'm in the bathroom, I'm in the living room, I'm in the kitchen and it just takes me a really long time to do stuff. Um, I do have ADD. Um, I stopped taking medication for it like, I don't know, like four years ago. Um, because I just like didn't want to be in anything and I just wanted to like be able to manage it like and my stress and my own whatever in my own way. Um, so the best thing that I have found that helps me when I'm trying to get stuff done around the house is by turning on other like mommy vloggers. Um, I don't know, just like seeing them get stuff done with their kids like helps me get stuff done. Um, Winnie is currently napping. Um, she went down like 20-ish minutes ago. And I'm gonna do my best to clean, I don't know, do some laundry, put some toys away, all the things. It uh, doesn't help getting stuff done when this is what my house looks like. Um, I've probably mentioned it before, but I'm opening um, a new salon space. Um, I, these were dropped off today, but so we have some shelves, table, cleaning supplies, garbage bags. This big thing is a mirror, um, a chandelier, backsplash, all my color and stuff, retail, and then kid toys. <laughs> so I just have a lot of just stuff everywhere, which definitely uh, adds to the stress. Hamo. Nap time is going pretty well. She uh, did wake up like at like 50 minutes and cried. <laughs> and I was like, Ooh! but she recovered. I kind of got ready. I washed my face and brushed my hair. <laughs> um, I was able to kind of pick up the living room. I did the dishes. Um, I haven't folded laundry yet. Um, I also sprayed down the bathroom with cleaner so that I can scrub that down later. Um, started the dishwasher, put a load of laundry in. Now I'm going to make a sandwich and if I have time I'm going to organize the fridge afterwards and then do this load of laundry quick. I'll probably fold the laundry while I eat my sandwich. That's, uh, that's what we got going on. You took a good nap. Hi. How was your sleep? How was your slumber? Oh, my big girl. Oh. Say hey. Hey. Say hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. You're a good piano player. Are you a good piano player? Uh oh. Good recovery. You trying to knock him down? Oh no! Oh no, don't do it! <gasps> oh my goodness, you knocked all the cups down. That's surprising. You always want to stand. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, uh oh, seven, eight. You got all your cookies. You playing the piano? Get those cups, get them. Oh no, you knocked them down. Good job. 
Are you trying to crawl? You just gotta move that leg out from underneath you. Oh. I mean, you definitely still get where you wanna go. <laughs> yeah. Just no actual crawling yet. We are having a hard boiled egg. We still have a couple leftover pierogies. For lunchy. <clears throat> Are you a little Danish baby? Winnie's making noises. She just said, ah, in her sleep. Can you tell us how your nap was? It was just fantastic. Hi, baby girl. <gasps> Hi. How was your nap? Why aren't you telling me about it? Oh my goodness. Is that it, baby? Say, I want food. Give me the foods. Hi. Oh my goodness. And we drank milky out of a sippy cup today. having some pancakes today? Okay, okay. Can we not use plates anymore? Was that the stage you're at? You just wanna throw them? Hey, can you tell me why you like the rug so much? You have all these toys that you could play with. That was not a real laugh. <laughs> What's with the fake laughs, Winnie? Wow, I just get the booty? Just get the booty! Oh wow, look at that pose. <laughs> Oh wow, so pretty little model. Uh -oh. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard these fake little giggles before. Uh, what is that? No, that's what I thought. Let's see those crawls. That's not a crawl. That's a squirm. Wow, look at how wet your bib is. Say hi. Hi, Winnie. Does anyone else feel like um, COVID and the pandemic like absolutely ruined your life? This is what I'm working with 
uh, 90% of the time. <laughs> if I'm not working, that's pretty much it. If I'm not working, I'm in pajamas from the day before, no teeth brushed, no hair brushed, no face washed, pretty much nothing. It's Friday today, so I'm going to try to get as much stuff cleaned up hey Mo, and organized, I guess, as best as I freaking can before Cody gets home. Um, Winnie is down for her first nap, so hopefully it's a good one. And uh, yeah, we will see how the day goes. T minus like two weeks until the new salon opens. I can't frickin' wait until all this crap is out of my living room because it's really, um, I literally can't even describe to you the amount of stress that this mess causes me every day. What are you doing? Come here. Come over here. What are you doing over there, you crazy girl? Come on. You know where you're going. Yeah, right? Come over here by mama. Got the rug. <gasps> Boom. Hi. Hi. Did you finally wake up and you aren't so crabby? You were pretty crabby when you first woke up. This is where we're at today. Can't be put down. Only wants to snuggle, but mama wants to do some stuff. Okay. Is that okay with you? And we are gonna try to do a little Valentine's Day craft for Daddy, but uh, I don't know how it's gonna go. Dad. Duh. Duh. Mom's gonna paint the bottom of your foot. I can't believe I'm doing this right now. <gasps> nope, don't touch it. Okay, okay. Did you get it on your hand? Yep, you already got it on your hand, perfect. Okay, let's stand on it on the ground. Okay. Okay. Okay, can you put your hand on here? horribly Are you talking to your brother? Say, hey, when did you take that camera out? What do you, what, what are you guys talking about? You're done with them? When your mom's making you cheeseburgers. Cheeseburgers probably with no cheese. Or bun. Are these your little burgers? That's a mama burger. That's also a mama burger. I thought you were drinking my wine. It's about to beat your ass. <sighs> nope, just a good old LaCroix. LaCroix. How many subscribers do you think it takes to get a LaCroix sponsorship? Probably a lot. Hopefully like 200. 
got. LaCroix, hit us up. Come on, you could have the face of Winslow on your next can. Look at that face. Look at that face. Ah, say, LaCroix. Ah. Oh, she's giving you guys kisses. Wow. So nice. Okay, she, that's enough kisses. She gives the wettest kisses. You haven't given dad a kiss in a week. You give the camera a kiss. She's giving me a kiss on my oh. Hey, oh, no, Winslow, can I have a kiss? Oh, Thank wow. you. Wow, Valentine's kiss for Dada. Friday night dinner, Winnie. You're eating the exact same thing we are. Mom even gave you ketchup like an absolute maniac. Is it yummy? Daddy doesn't approve of the ketchup. Winslow loves beef. Top five food for her. I would say top three.